Back when we were kids, our parents warned us not to swallow chewing gum. Some of us still remember those terrible prophecies. It will take seven years to pass through your gut before it's digested. Some said it'll stay in your stomach forever. Few others said it'll clog up your butt. Well, the time has finally come to dispel these lingering fears. So what really happens if you accidentally happen to swallow a chewing gum? Chewing gum is made out of gum base, sweeteners, coloring, and flavoring. The gum base is pretty indigestible. It's a mixture of elastomers, resins, fats, emulsifiers, and waxes. Most of the time, your stomach really cannot break down the gum the way it would break down other foods. However, your digestive system has another way to deal with things you swallow. After all, we eat lots of things that we are unable to fully digest. For example, gluten in bread and lactose in milk cannot be digested by our bodies. Some people are more sensitive to gluten and lactose than others. The gut just keeps moving them along until they make it all the way through the intestines and come out the other end. So gum usually ends up in your laboratory one or two days later. Even though gum is sticky, it's usually no match for the power of your gut. Our saliva will make an attempt at digesting chewing gum as soon as we put it in our mouths. It might penetrate the shell and sweeteners, but much of the gum's base ingredients are indigestible. It's then down to our stomach muscles, which contract and relax, much like the way an earthworm moves, to slowly force the things that we swallow through our systems. The system can still get gummed up, though. Swallowing a huge wad of gum or swallowing many small pieces of gum in a short time can cause a blockage within the digestive system, most often in children who have a smaller diameter digestive tract than adults, but this is extremely rare. Are some kids too young for gum? Kids shouldn't chew gum until they fully understand the importance of not swallowing it. By age five, most children will understand that gum is different than candy and is not to be swallowed. So if you have younger brothers or sisters, don't offer them gum until they're older and your mom or dad says it's okay.